Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 1,102. Hey, if you want to download this workbook, 1,101, 1,102, click on the link below the video. Hey, in this video, we have three different lists of movies, scary movies, funny movies, romantic movies. And you have the option of listing your top four in any one of these columns. And the one, two, three, four could come anywhere between these tables. And we want to be able to look at anything entered here and just list the top four. So I'm going to try VLOOKUP. VLOOKUP, I'm going to look up the number one comma within this table right here. F4, comma, column index number. I want to return the movie from the second column, so 2, comma. And the first column is not sorted, so I have to use exact match, false, or 0. Now, what's going to happen here? It's going to look up number 1, look through the first column, and not find it. So it's polite. It says not available. So what are we going to do? Well, we're going to try if error. So if error. Now, in the old days before if error, We'd have to use is error around VLOOKUP inside the if and run the VLOOKUP twice. But if error is great because we only have to run VLOOKUP once. VLOOKUP either returns the value it finds or an error. So if it's an error, well, we're going to have to run this whole thing again but the second table. Copy. So here I'm going to look up the same number, but watch this. Table array, I'm going to highlight it, highlight the second table, F4. All right, so comma, this is the second if error. I still need to do something if it's an error. Well, I'm going to have to run it again, Control V. I come down and click inside V lookup. I can click on the screen tip, highlight the table, highlight the, sec the third table, F4. Comma, and finally, at the end of the third if error, I can put whatever I want. I want double quote, null text string, which means show nothing. Close parentheses, whoa. Close parentheses, close parentheses. Not until I see a black one do I have to control enter. Double click and send it down. So now if I were to change all my numbers, one, two, Four, three, right? And so they would repopulate. Control Z, 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 Z. I'll leave those original ones in. All right, so that's a that's a big long formula with lots of if errors and V lookups. All right, we'll see you next video.